For those that weren't able to watch my previous video where I explained my upcoming projects, uh, I went into detail about my storage area. So my storage area is underneath my deck. Um, I wanted to use, utilize that space. So what I did was is that uh, I created a storage space and I actually used panels to divert the water coming off from the deck. And it was a major fail. So not only was I not able to use that storage area, but whatever stuff was in there uh, got wet. And so uh, my current project, what we're working on today, is to remake the storage area. So behind this door is uh, the first project. And yes, that is extremely ugly good morning beautiful day second week anniversary of my retirement i gotta clean this out so we're gonna do it uh time lapse not a lot to enjoy but you do get to see me quite a bit we'll see you soon sweating for those people that didn't realize that I actually sweat and I work uh, a couple things one I've got it cleaned out um, the second thing is more technical um, this is not really what you'd call a, a good pose when you're on the camera but uh, one of my well my only short um, tripod one of the legs broke off I don't know how you're supposed to be the next YouTube sensation with equipment keeps breaking but that's for another day um, I'm gonna turn the camera off because what I need to do is I need to dig deep into my inner hoarder and see if I can get rid of some of this stuff because a lot of this stuff should be gotten rid of and then when we get back to a clean room start the next phase taking the panels down I'll turn the camera back on see ya okay so I have officially cleaned it out. I started taking some of the uh, screws out that's holding up this uh, corrugated ceiling. Um, as you can tell on the floor, it was holding, one panel was holding a lot of water, which is contrary to the way we want it to work. So I'm going to now take some of these, now I'm gonna wait. So just give you guys a little bit of update. Okay, I'm not sure if you can see this, but all this uh, dirt, nastiness on this floor came from the top of the panels. And the top of the panels got that nastiness 
from everything that fell through the slits between the planks on my deck. So those, all those little cracks right there, years and years of dirt, dust, leaves. And look, here's my panels. I hope the sun's, and here's the panels and all the dirt and let's just say crap, crap that's on the panels. So now it's cleanup time and uh, I'll be back. The thought provoking quote of the day is from Confucius. Confucius was a philosopher and historian that lived in China around 550 BC. He said, if I am walking with two other men, each of them will serve as my teacher. I will pick out the good points of the one and in imitate them and the bad points of the other and correct them in myself. That's Confucius from 550 BC. Audio. Um, I was using a new GoPro wannabe uh, and I haven't quite got figured out the sound yet so you'll see me explaining looking very intelligent as I do this but what I'm actually explaining this is that I plan on overlapping all the panels and screwing them in to every joist so I have a solid um, method for the water to flow out so that gives you a little insight to what I was uh, explaining. Well, the project is done. Um, the storage area, I probably spent about three hours today finishing up. I didn't really film in a lot of it because it was small areas, very hot. Uh, uh, may have cussed a couple of times. I don't know. Probably not, you know, since I, I don't do that. Um, but anyway, uh, it, uh, and, and the, one of the good things that happened last night was right when I was finishing, uh, it came, it started raining. So any area, uh, that, uh, that I needed to address, I was able to do so quickly because it was raining. And so I figured we'll just take a look at uh, the result. So let's go. Ooh, it's very hot. All right, let's look inside real quick. All right, so as you can see, um, the roof is up. And uh, unlike last time, um, I, um, I hit every floor joist of the deck or ceiling joist if you're down here I hit every joist with a nail I mean with a screw about every four or five inches so all the way up and all the way down um, I hit it with screw uh, it stepped down from uh, zero at the first joist quarter inch half inch three quarter inch 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 and a quarter an inch and a half and then it goes out um out over the top of this wall right here so um in addition to that every section where it came two pieces came together i used uh tie back uh the tape um uh, very good tape too i've never used it before i'm not sponsored of course because who would sponsor me, but it's good tape. Um, as you can tell too, I've organized um, the bikes, the lawnmower, power washer, all this, all the tools were in the garage, so they've been moved now. So um, I'm anxious to see it rain again. I'm anxious to see how well I did. Um, is it 100%? Um, no, nothing in this world is 100% other than my 
my good looks and intelligence. But other than that, uh, no, I, I can I can pretty well guarantee it'll probably it's probably about 97, 98 uh, percent uh, dried. Uh, I'm sure we'll get some some leakage somewhere, but uh, I feel very confident, and that's the reason why I moved everything to the to the storage area. So. Um, for the first project that uh, I started really after I retired um, is storage area and I think I've accomplished it. So all said three days on and off um, storage room is complete. I appreciate you watching. Thank you very much. God bless and we'll see you on the next project.